Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Chase with Rocky Mountain HVMC and today we are showing you the new Prospect Amplifier Goggle from Scott. Hello everyone and thank you for checking in. Long overdue. Those are the two words that I have for the new Prospect Amplifier Goggle from Scott. And the reason that I say that because the Prospect goggle has been around for a while now and I was waiting for them to finally come out with an injection molded optically correct lens, which is now what you are getting in the amplifier. And they also have the amplifier technology, which is the coating that goes on the lens, which is built to compete with say the prism lens from Oakley or the hyper lens from 100% built to just give you better clarity, better, better contrast, so you have better vision when you're out there riding. So we're gonna go through, we'll talk about this goggle. Looks wise, it's identical to the Prospect, same frame, same everything. So yes, if you have an older Prospect goggle, you can buy just the amplifier lens and put it into that goggle, so remember that. Fit wise, very, very comfortable goggle. One thing I've noticed too about the Prospect since day one, very, very lightweight too. So I like that, the fit is good. The only thing that I've ever noticed with the Prospect goggle is the frame on these, looking at them, disclaimer, I'm gonna say it now, my favorite looking goggle of all time. I'll go on record saying that. But the frame is pretty big, and from my experience, depending on say what helmet you're wearing these in, for example, with this bell, this frame fills up that entire eye port. And I've noticed from time to time that the helmet will press down on the top of the goggle and it kind of pushes it on the top of my nose, which is not my favorite. So that is something that I've experienced, but remember, any goggle that we sell, we have our fit guarantee. If you get these, if you're not happy with how they fit, so try them on at home, try them on with your helmet, don't go riding in it. But if you don't like how they fit, you can send it back in brand new unused condition and we'll give you free shipping both ways on your first exchange just to make sure you get the size and the fit that you're gonna be happiest with. Now, with the Prospect, like I said, it's been around for a while, they've updated the lens, which was, for me, it needed to be done because this is their premium goggle, and we've seen other companies for a long time now that have had injection molded optically correct lenses. Now, looking at it though, the strap on the Prospect, it's a 50 millimeter strap. They always have really, really cool colorways available in the Prospect, but you've got your silicone on here, which is what you'd expect, so that's just gonna keep the strap in place so it doesn't slide on the helmet. And then with the foam, one aspect about the foam on the Prospect that I like, it's triple layer phase foam, like I said, super comfortable, but you kind of have these dimples in here and that's for sweat management. So those dimples or pores, if you want to call it that, are just there to help absorb more sweat so it's not dripping into your eyes. If you've ever ridden when you're super hot and sweaty, I hate when my sweat drips into the goggles. So these are there to help combat that and absorb as much moisture as possible. You've got good venting on here. That's one thing about these two that I like is they don't fog up very easily. You've got foam all the way around the top and the sides and the bottom to help get that airflow going in there. With the outrigger system, premium feature, and what I like about Scott's is they pivot a lot and you can really feel those when you put this goggle on. And the purpose for an outrigger is, you can see it right here in this bell, is the straps connected to these versus the frame of the goggle. So when you put those on, it prevents the strap from wanting to pull the frame away from the rider's face. So you just maintain a good tight seal all the way around. The clarity on these is really good, really, really good. Just overall field of vision. The Peripheral vision is really good. Up and down is also great. Again, you're gonna expect that when you see a goggle with a frame this large. But now let's talk about the lens because this is the big update. Like I said, you now have the injection molded, which means this lens is already curved before it goes into the goggle, which means it's optically correct. So not only is it a little bit thicker, so it's offering even more safety for your eyes, but now when you look through it, it doesn't distort your vision. And if you were to put a pair of these on and back to back with just the standard prospect, you will notice and you'll see just that little bit of distortion that you get from a traditional Lexan lens that you will bend when you put it into the frame. So if you're looking for the best vision possible, you do want an injection molded lens. Also, like I said, they have their new amplifier technology, which is there to compete with the other brands that have this. And it's just to improve the contrast. So when you look through this lens, what it does is that when light comes through, is that it's taking that light and it's not making it hard on your eyes, but it also just improves the contrast so you can see better. So maybe you're in a shaded area and you've got some ruts that you're going through. It's just gonna help you distinguish the different colors and the shades of that dirt to just help give you the best vision possible. So really cool lens technology with that. You can see up here right now when this first came out, there's two lens colors available. They have a rose base 
which is the one that I have right here in front of me. And then there's a gold plated version, which is more of it, which has the chrome finish on it. The gold plate of the chrome is a little bit darker than just the rose. If you were to ask me personally, I prefer just the rose tint because it's not as dark as the chrome. And so for me, I want to be able to have a goggle that does have some tint, so in bright sunlight, it's making it a little bit easier on my eyes. But if you know if it does become overcast, if I am riding in some shady or cloudy conditions, I don't want it to be too dark to where it's a little bit difficult for me to see. So I prefer the rose, but again, all the lenses are interchangeable. You can buy separate lenses if you want to. But overall, with the Prospect, like I said, long overdue as far as the injection mode and lens go, it's lens goes. It's cool to see they have the amplifier technology, my favorite looking goggle very comfortable, a lot of cool colorways. Last thing I will say is that there is a nose guard that comes included. And I'm gonna tell you right now, I did not put it on this goggle for this video because it's kind of a pain in the butt. I'm not gonna lie, it's probably one of the harder nose guards to install on a goggle. So that really is my only gripe with this. Aside from that, this thing is killer. If you have questions or comments, we would love to get those answered, so make sure to leave those below. To grab your set today, you can click on the link or head over to RockyMountAtvMC.com. As always, all orders are $75 ship free, which means these are going to ship free. And if you like this product spotlight, you want to see more like it, get subscribed to the Rocky Mountain YouTube channel, hit that notification bell, and stay up to date. I'm Chase, and we'll see you on the trails.